The Packers playing the Seahawks tomorrow. Nothing quite says welcome back to Lambeau like a brand new mural right across the street from the stadium on a fence that will be seen by everyone. NBC 26's Eric Crest explains just how the work of art was created. For decades, Packers fans on their way to Lambeau have noticed the yellow fences with catchy slogans. But one of those fences in particular is sure to catch your eye this season. It's been a long day for these two artists. They started at 5.30 Saturday morning to begin the biggest project they've ever worked on. Well, I've done a few smaller murals before, but nothing of this scale. Normally, I like to take my time on mural works, but this is a deadline of only one day. Both have their own unique set of skills to get the oversized job done. I'm only good with the brush, but he does magic with that can. And when your canvas is 70 feet by 6 feet and the clock is ticking, a little motivation coming from Lombardi Avenue is always welcome. Getting honked at well over 100 times. Every two or three minutes we're going to get honk. Even calling the Jimmy John's guy and dropping off some lunch here, he was pretty stoked to see the mural. So the question on the tip of everyone's tongue, what is the mural? You're going to see Eddie Lacy reaching out for the Super Bowl 50 trophy, which will eventually be at Lambeau Field. Uh, with the saying, Cheesehead Nation, and a bunch of Swiss cheese cheese holes that are 3D kind of behind. A welcome change for many that are used to seeing your traditional slogan or creative catchphrase. It's not the kind of art you'd see normally on these fences. Usually it's just a saying, block letters. And it was all designed and completed by a couple of young men who weren't paid a dime. We're Packer fans. We're not doing this to be, get paid. We're doing this because we love our team, and we're doing something for the greatest franchise in the world. Which goes to show the lengths that true Packers fans will go. It's a crowd pleaser. Not for art, but for their team. As if those artists didn't get enough attention today, Eddie Lacy caught wind of the mural this afternoon on social media and tweeted to his nearly 300,000 followers this mad cool. We're all glad they're getting some attention. Eric Crest, NBC 26.